For the first time since he shot and killed his girlfriend on the 14th of February, Oscar Pistorius has spent a night outside a police cell. He's been granted bail by a magistrate in Pretoria who ordered the athlete also to surrender his passport. After four gruelling days in court, the Olympian looked composed but weary. He showed no emotion through the day but broke down when the chief magistrate made his decision, having considered the athlete's version of events. That reaching out in the affidavit in the way that he did, placing it before the court, together with the fact that none of the factors that need to be established have been established, I come to the conclusion that the accused has made a case to be released on bail. Yes! Oscar Pistorius says he mistook his girlfriend, Reva Steenkamp, for a burglar, shooting her three times through a toilet door. The chief magistrate thought parts of his story were improbable, but he wasn't convinced by the prosecution's case that this was premeditated murder. His family are relieved. There are going to be tough times ahead, but the family is just living for the moment right now. We are relieved that the fact that Oscar got bailed today. But at the same time, we are in mourning for the death of Riva with her family. We know Oscar's uh, version of what happened at that tragic night and we know that that is the truth and that will prevail in the coming court cases. He's out of prison, yes, but the Paralympic gold medalist left court knowing his life is very different now. He has to surrender his passport and find a million South African rand as bail surety and he'll have to get permission from the authorities if he wants to leave Pretoria. But a young woman has died a violent death, and it's just over a week since Reva Steenkamp's life was abruptly ended, and those who loved her are still in shock. Whatever happens, is, it's not going to bring Reva back, you know. I just want justice and the truth. The double amputee now has until June before his next court appearance. Then the real battle begins. Pistorius told court officials he shot the woman because he mistook her for an intruder. Prosecutors said Pistorius had planned the shooting. His defense lawyers discredited the police investigation. They said testimony by the lead detective was untrustworthy. Pistorius is expected to be released on bail of about $113,000. Outside the court, it was a different story as the athlete's family and supporters cheered. Bail was set at around 85,000 euros. Reva Steenkamp was shot dead at the home of Pistorius after he fired four times through a bathroom door. Prosecutors say the 29-year-old model was a victim of premeditated murder. His defense is that he mistook her for an intruder. Pistorius was removed from the scene by police to face South Africa's justice system. Details from both prosecution and defense have emerged in court throughout the week. The athlete's fame was a factor in the bail decision after his defense team argued that he was too distinctive to go anywhere unnoticed. He faces life if convicted. Outside, a court that was hanging on each development were generally mixed about Pistorius' freedom. An innocent woman was prematurely murdered. And then we wanted justice for her. We don't believe um, that bail was sufficient at this point in time. I believe that Oscar should have been kept behind bars to serve time for the hideous murder that he committed. I mean, whether or not it was premeditated. Others are sympathetic. I'm quite happy that he's been given bail. The nation is already divided. And uh, I think that more the younger generation feel a bit of sympathy towards Oscar. And it's more the older generation that feel that, no, he, he should go to jail, he should be put to the sword. Pistorius is out on bail of one million rand, about $112,000. There are other conditions, including he must give up his passport so he cannot leave the country, he must report to police twice a week, and he can't drink alcohol, which didn't bother his attorney much after the hearing. 
Ms. Lurie, how concerned doing? are you about the issue of alcohol? I mean, how concerned are you about leading to a big No, he doesn't happen? drink, so that's fine. But Pistorius is also barred from going to the scene of a crime. So as he was driven off this afternoon, he knew he could not go home and would be staying with his family. The family telling CNN they'll be watching him closely during this time.